Oh, I'm here to admit something entrepreneurial in nature. I am afraid. I am afraid of producing content for the internet specifically. Um, it's a fear I guess we all have of putting ourselves out there and I'd love to learn what YouTube has to offer. So I am taking my first plunge with a video. I hear the house coming apart right now because there is a windstorm here in Colorado Springs. But needless to say, less to fear trying to do this content thing. So where's content supposed to be? I think content means to be in the front of mind. They say in marketing it takes seven touches before someone is willing to invest in your product. And I have that science fairy, which I bring enrichment. Um, enrichment to kids, it's preschool age, that's science, technology, engineering, and math based, allows them to realize they can be concrete content creators, that they have nothing to fear, and then that they also can interact with the real world, um, you know, the pieces of science that make it a doing, uh, where kids who learn by doing um, find a little bit of reprieve. So the sciences were that for me, um, meaning I write like a scientist. And in content, you need to not write like a scientist. Scientists use very large words to describe things, and they use a lot of clauses. Um, also is, um, I spreche flüssig Deutsch. So because of the German, I also tend to make my clauses very large, and the verbs never agree. So that English lesson aside, um, I think I like video. We'll see, you know, to have your face and your name and that like frozen, like stuck video with your face all contorted. Um, I'm sure I will have a lot of those people. Um, but in the end, it comes down to communicating effectively. And I do that um, from my heart and with my hands. And this is an opportunity to record that content, record my entrepreneurial journey. Um, because that is so important for anyone with a dream, a tinkerer, a starter. You just have to go for it, no matter how scary it is. That's a good, good emotion. It means you're trying to do it right. So, yeah, plain English. Copy. Uh, copy is writing, and writing for the purpose of persuasion, um, usually to buy or sell buy a product. Um, so, but copy is important in communicating the message, and communicating that straightforwardly. So, uh, copy. I could use some help if you're a copy editor out there and you're looking for a client. Can't pay you right now, but I would love to talk um, and learn how to do that better. There's so many resources out there. The podcasts, the books, the, the conversations that you're able to have as an entrepreneur are invaluable. So really remember, focusing on those is going to help with this, this content curation. You know who your audience is. You know how to communicate with them. You know what things they're into. You know, these are all important for that final final sale. Um, so overall, I am expecting to find my voice through video. And more than anything on the internet, I see authenticity. Like, this is who I am. And I am me. And I am good at being me. I am very good at being Laura Weiler. There's a lot to that, and so if I can convey that here, bravo, there we go. So excuse the random words in another uh, language, my goal is actually to focus um, on speaking very plain English um, instead of techno jargon that my molecular biology background loves. Um, so because I am a scientist and a biologist, I accept a certain amount of chaos, which frustrates probably a lot of other scientists, but is great for working uh, in that preschool setting with kids. Um, so yeah, I'd love to you know talk about metrics, uh, measuring what we do, measuring the effectiveness of copy. Um, I think it's the only way to become greater. So if this is my fear, I think I've got it figured out.